I think we're comfortable now. Are we comfortable now? I'm Sophia, comfortable. are you comfortable? Are you going to get off the phone? Okay. Say goodbye. Welcome to Tuesday No Tag Vlogmas with Christy. It's not Sunday. Today is Tuesday. But we. What's the date? Today's the December 12th. Anyway, Christy and Sophia decided that they would do the tag with me today for Tuesday. Um, <clears throat> if you watch my daily vlog, you know that Danny did this with me with Jim a couple weeks ago. And uh, Jim didn't hit the record button. <laughs> so we went on for like 20, like 25 minutes. Jim? Your dad, Jim, yes. Uh, so we, we, and it was fun. It really was fun. But you'll never see it. You'll never know. So anyway. Can't reenact it. Can't reenact it. Sorry. It's done. So <laughs> Sophia and uh, Christy are going to do this with me. And it is a, I forgot what I even called it. It's my tag too. Got to find the questions. Mm -hmm. She's not prepared. I was prepared, but then they these people just drive me crazy. Um, it's this or that. It's which one would you rather have? And if you think of a story that relates to it, you can you can share it. So, would you rather have eggnog or hot cocoa? Hot cocoa. Hot cocoa. Hot cocoa. Hot cocoa. But you got to have marshmallows in it. I'm not a big fan of the marshmallows in it. You have to have marshmallows in it. And I like the little colored ones better, like the different flavors. What do you think? Just plain old. And I make my hot chocolate with hot water and then I add a little bit of milk. No, I like to make it with all milk. I just make it in the coffee maker. In the Keurig. Oh, in the Keurig. Doesn't the next, when you make coffee then after that, doesn't it taste like hot chocolate then? No, usually sometimes I notice when you make the hot chocolate after coffee, it kind of tastes like coffee. Mm. Um, number two, mittens or gloves? Gloves. Gloves. Mittens. Because then your hands are all together and they stay warm. Well, that too. And you can wave to somebody, but you could really be flipping them off. <laughs> We're a nice channel here. We don't do that stuff. Well, they must not know me. She is her mother's daughter. So you could be waving, but really be like. Is that your mom saying stuff like that? Number three, a sweater or a turtleneck? Oh, a sweater. I would I would rather go in my bra. Oh, that would be a sight. <laughs> Who would want to see that? I cannot wear a sweater or a turtleneck. But you're wearing a sweatshirt. You're wearing a hoodie. That's the same thing. I know, but I have a shirt on underneath, so if I get hot. But this is like my jacket. But you could wear a sweater and then take the sweater off with the shirt underneath. Uh, I'm just going to have a sweater. This is different. It's a hoodie. She's going to be so disappointed when she opens up the turtlenecks that I got her for Christmas. <laughs> well, I'll be going back. I wouldn't laugh. You're getting turtlenecks too. We're getting brawls. <laughs> um, I would pick a sweater. Because I... You don't even have an ugly Christmas sweater that you no. wear at work? I mean, I know you work from home now, but... No. And those are, like, kind of itchy. Like, I don't I don't like sweaters. You're weird. Number four, would you rather make a snowman or snow angels? Um, uh, probably a snow angel. Oh, a snowman. I like snowmen. I think that they're better. I'd like snow to angels see you make a snow angel, though. I would never be able to get up off the ground. <laughs> That's why she's saying that. See how mean she is to her mother? I would have a problem getting down and then have an even bigger problem getting up. Well, just go on your treadmill. <laughs> I going down. See, they don't care about me. They just don't care. I could have been seriously hurt. If you haven't seen that video, my first, well, it was the third day I had the, I had the treadmill. I was brought, walking on the treadmill, and I thought I could increase my speed by at least two-tenths of a mile. And I increased it by six miles an hour, which got me flying. And then I tried to hit the stop button, but instead I kept hitting the 0 .2, 0 .2, 0 .2, 0 .2, and I kept going faster and faster until I finally slammed down and fell and slid, blah, 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 fell off. But do my family care? No. Um... That really made your day. Even when I told Christy, when I called her, she laughed on the phone. <laughs> I, 
I, she didn't even, the first things out of her mouth were, were you hurt? It wasn't. It was like, <laughs> oh, that's my family though. Um, number five, would you rather eat a gingerbread cookie or a sugar cookie? A sugar, sugar cookie. cookie. I'm not a fan of either one, but I could choke a sugar cookie down. I would pick the, um, well, I like them both. I like the ginger snaps. Mm -hmm. You dip them in tea, get them a little soft. I like the, I don't know, I think they're like a ginger cookie, but the little windmill cookies that Grammy used to get. Yeah, the almond. Yeah, they have like, like little yeah, they're walnuts like a ginger, or something. Yeah, they're like, I like those. Those are good. Those are expensive, That reminds though. me. I know Jimmy doesn't watch. You'd think he'd watch the channel, but the only time he watches them when he's doing on it. But I remember he likes the little he's window so cookies. He's so vain. No, Danny is the one that's vain. Danny will only watch my videos when he's on them. So comment bad things about him. Tell him he's going bald. <laughs> he is. He's got a big bald spot. I don't know. I should send you the picture. I <laughs> should insert as the thumbnail to this video. <laughs> Oh, such love between my children. Oh. It makes me feel so good to know there's so much love. Um, so I would pick a gingerbread cookie. Um, number six, would you rather have a candy cane or peppermint bark? What a candy cane? Candy cane. I, I say Reluctantly. candy Reluctantly. You know, somebody, somebody has been eating the candy canes off the tree. I had one. Well, I don't care about that, but I, I thought it was you because it was in next to your seat. What seat? When you sit in the... I don't sit there. Oh, you have an assigned seat that everybody knows of that tree. I don't seat. sit by that Christmas tree. No, it wasn't by that Christmas tree. It was where you sat. I didn't even notice there was candy canes. Well, we do there. even when we do our Christmas presents. We open our presents. People know. Don't sit in that seat. That's Christy's seat. That is. They just know. I, it on the table. Yeah, it was on the table between the two chairs. We're I doing it where you sit. I didn't even notice. Hmm. Um, number seven, would you rather watch the movie or read the book? Mm. Oh, this is a hard one. Watch the movie. I'd rather read the book than watch the movie. <laughs> I would probably be the same way because I feel like the movie takes a, doesn't take as much. You get more from the book than you do the movie. I agree. Definitely. Um, would you rather be sitting by a fireside or sledding and tobogganing? Um, you'd be sitting by the fire. Um, you gotta what, talk what's the second one mean? Like it's tobogganing. Sledding like, or tobogganing down the hill. You're going like in a, in an ice luge. I'll go sledding. I like tobogganing and sledding, but it's been years. Well, that treadmill experience says <laughs> that you shouldn't be either or. <laughs> but I would say I'd, I like to sit by the fireside. When we go up to the cottage, we like to have a, a nice little campfire. Mm -hmm. We always do that. Number nine, fuzzy socks or slippers? Slippers. Fuzzy socks. I, I know I have to pick one. I would pick neither. Fuzzy socks are slippery, and that means I would fall. So I don't want well, that. Well, these are slippers. You can get grippy ones. Yeah, but I don't like things on my feet. I, I just, um, to me, a slipper is like a shoe, and I don't like wearing shoes. So if I had to pick, I would pick a fuzzy sock and have my cane handy. I know I'm going to slide and fall. I always think of that movie with Sandra Bullock, Crash. I don't think I've seen that. Oh, it was a good movie. you got to watch that movie. When it shows how everybody's lives are interchanged. Like somebody was calling and complaining to, to somebody about the, his health insurance, but it turned out that she was related to something else and something just all the way down the line. It was a very good movie. But um, And when she was going down the steps, her fuzzy socks... She slid, and then she ended up falling down the stairs. And then she found out who her true friend was. Spoiler alert. It wasn't her daughter who laughed at her. No, it wasn't her daughter who laughed at her. That's true. Um, number 10, would you rather build a snowman or have a snowball fight? Probably build a snowman because I'm going to get salty if I get hit with a, snow, a snowball. A snowball fight? See, I would have thought you would have picked a snowball fight because you like to take your aggressions out on people. I do, but I don't like when they take their aggressions out on me. Well, is that it? Um, I would, uh, I like a snowball fight. I would be throwing snow at... Uh, She'd fall before she got one at me. <laughs> probably. Uh, number 11, ice skating or skiing? Oh, probably neither because I feel like I would break a bone on that, eat both of those. Ice skating, because then I could, like, go with my friends. 
I would I would pick ice skating, and I do remember that Jim had did have a story about the ice skating because uh, well, when we did the video before, when Jim and I first started dating, I said he was cheap. He said he was frugal. We would go on a lot of things that cost nothing. So we did in the winter, because we met on January 18th. 1965. 1967. 1967. 1967. And so it was winter, so we did a lot of ice skating because there was a pond by us that was, or our skating rink rather, that was free. We went to a lot of free basketball games. Yes, for your school. Well, they were free. We didn't have, and we were we were on a date the one time, and he was going to get a, a Coke and a bag of chips, and I said, I'll have one, and he held his hand up, and he says, where's your money? We were on a date. And sounds I had to like buy, something Danny would do. <laughs> and I had to pay for my own chip, and he remembers that, too. Um, number 12. Oh, and the skiing. I always wanted to join the ski club at school. But I thought you had to know how to ski, and that was until I graduated that I found out that at the ski club they taught you how to ski. <laughs> Not that I would be able to ski now, because obviously I can't walk on a treadmill. It's That's been true. pointed out. Um, number 12, a fuzzy robe or flannel pajamas? Robe. A flannel pajamas. I would say a fuzzy robe. I'd like a fuzzy robe. Um, number 13, candy canes or chocolate Santas? Chocolate Santas. Santas. I like the chocolate Santas too. And number 14, an artificial tree or a real tree? I like a real tree, but I have an artificial tree. A real tree. I like a real tree, but I don't like the mess from a real tree. And especially with the price of the trees now, I just can't see spending that much money for a tree that you're only going to have in the house for a couple of weeks. Mm -hmm. So I would I stick with my... And I know the artificial trees aren't environmentally friendly, but... I have my artificial trees forever, so I don't see that there's a problem with that. And the last question, do you like your tree with white lights or colorful lights? Colorful. White lights. Colorful. I know a lot of people say that you shouldn't have a tree with a lot of, just with white lights. I don't know. I like a colorful light. Mine are, mine have like the pre-lit colorful lights, and then I even put extra strands of colorful lights on. Yeah, we do that too. But Christy has a Wizard of Oz mm -hmm. tree also. I do. Every ornament. And then the tree skirt is the yellow brick road. Yes. And the star is a ruby red star. And she has a clock that barks every hour. It's my favorite clock. It's like a cuckoo clock, but instead of a bird coming out, Toto comes out and barks every hour on the hour. Even at night when it's dark? Yeah. Oh, that would be annoying. I have a oh, clock. like the grandfather clock. You can't even hear it. You well, don't, used you to don't it, yeah. hear it anymore. That's true. I don't hear it anymore. That's true. But the cuckoo clock that your grand, your dad got me for Christmas last year, I do hear that. Which one? It's the one that's on the mantle. I don't think I've ever heard that. Oh, it's annoying. Um, the the Christmas one. The Christmas one. Oh, I haven't heard that one yet. Yeah, you'll hear it. One time the mm -hmm. um, the cuckoo clock was like out of batteries and I finally thought I got used to it and I thought my mom didn't notice it didn't have batteries and then my mom noticed it didn't, it wasn't barking every hour and she got my dad to change the batteries or I think she changed the batteries okay. and I was so mad. I'll turn it up because you can turn the volume up and down. If Christy remembers to send me a picture of her Wizard of Oz tree, I'll insert it right here. I have a picture. Oh, you have a picture? Oh, then she can send me the picture. Stella's uh, in it. Laying by the Christmas tree. Her trans dog. Listen, you should. I want you to put insert a picture. I'm going to also of, insert the picture of the dog, the bearded dog. The bearded dog. It is the most beautiful beard on a female dog. On a dog you will ever see. She is just a beaut. Well, well, I will insert those pictures here. So that's going to do it for Vlogmas December tag. Um, Christmas Day and New Year's Eve, New Year's Day, Joan at Joan's Point of Plate is doing um, sending out questions. 
but she's looking for suggestions. So if anybody has any suggestions of some questions that you might like to hear on a Christmas or a New Year's tag, put them down in the comments below and I will forward them on to Joan. And so on Christmas Day and New Year's Day, look for tag videos um, from the usual suspects. So in the description box down below, I'm gonna have a listing of everybody that's participating in this particular um, tag. And I'll also have the links to their channel, go over to their channels and watch the videos. Also subscribe to their channels because you will not be disappointed. And once again, if you have any Christmas questions or New Year's questions that you'd like, put them in the comments below and I will forward them to June. So in the meet, June. Joan. June is my mom. June is June. Christy. Yep. June bug. Din. My dad used to call her Din, D-I-N. Why? It's just a nickname he had for her, Din. I think we have that on her. I wouldn't know because I'm not a grave person. Don't we have that on her headstone? I can. I have a picture of her gravestone somewhere in my phone. I we'll have look. to look. We'll have to look. Let's see. I, I'm not. Christy's a grave person, so I, I'm, I'm well knowing that she'll be there saying, "Are you on the treadmill? Are you on the treadmill?" <laughs> Did God push you off yet? <laughs> All right. Like, comment, subscribe, and share. Talk to you soon. Bye. Mm -hmm.